the slightest bit jealous. Well, you're going to have to work harder, girl. You'll crack in the end. George doesn't get jealous. He's the man who has everything. What? A pullover and a health shop? <laughs> Listen, and my husband took me for granted. I told him I was having an affair with a milkman. The milkman? That's not very original. No, but it's true. <laughs> I don't believe it, Dr Crispin. He does come into the work some days, you know. No, in the paper, look. Oh, he's not flogging those stair lifts again. <laughs> Doc, happy and bashful. TV doctor Piers Crispin has fallen for the sunny charms of Carol Spencer, Wake Up Britain's bubbly weather girl. Announcing their engagement yesterday, Dr Piers joked, I forecast blue skies, hot nights... And an exceptionally warm front. <laughs> the dashing Doc went on... I only hope they can read my writing in the wedding register. <laughs> Page six. Page six. <laughs> I'm always here <clears throat> on page six. Oh, look. There's more. A friend said, that should scotch the rumours that he's gay. What? <laughs> what does it say there? Oh, very funny. Lucky for you, the only cloud on my horizon is cloud nine. Piers, why didn't you tell us you were getting married? I wanted you to find out in the appropriate way. Through the press. <laughs> what do you think? Pretty gorgeous, eh? Yes, she looks great. What? Oh, yes, so she does. <laughs> if I didn't know you better, I'd think you were just doing this for the publicity. <laughs> oh, I do know you better. Oh, Mrs Raven, so cynical and yet so ugly. <laughs> why is it that nobody can believe I'm capable of genuine emotion? We're in love. It says so in paragraph three. <laughs> Morning, girls. Oh, George, you've seen this. Piers is in the paper. You're not flogging those stair lifts again. No, no. <laughs> I'm getting married. Oh, well done, Piers. It's great being married. When Janet and I got married, I remember thinking, now I can relax. No more faffing about with small talk. Sex on tap whenever you want it. <laughs> No change for me there, then. So, that's what you think marriage is about? Oh, no, not just that. There's all the money you can save on restaurant bills and flowers. Excuse me. Oh, Mr Harris, come for your travel jabs. That's right. Go on, girl, get in there, make him jealous. <laughs> well, let's be having you. Oh, golly, Mr Harris, have you been working out? Well, you know, now and then. <laughs> <laughs> Very impressive. Here, let me feel. That is impressive. Congratulations. <laughs> nice bonds, too. Oh, for God's sake, George, have you no thought for my feelings at all? I'm sorry, Janet. <laughs> nice bonds as well. <laughs>